Hello and welcome everyone. Today I have a great game for you. It takes place on the Jeebus King template, similar to Jeebus Cross but features even more tempo. All the bosses are either XP or army. XP? Butterbots and XP. And Butterbots. Not farming that I didn't want to have in my army anyway. Ba -ba. How many birds? That artifacts are removed and you're guaranteed a certain number of creature banks every single time. This template is made by MKC, and this is a match that takes place in a tournament also hosted by him. Much love to MKC for hosting this, and I hope you guys have a great watch. I hope you're gonna do something with your writing today. Yeah, me too, I guess. So, we go Rampy, we go Ivor. Nah, we should go Kiri. Nah, we should go Ivor. Nah, we should go Kiri. Nah, we go Kiri. Nah, we should go Mephala. Nah, we should go Kiri. Nah, we're fine. Fuck it. Nah, we should go Eivor. I don't know what we're doing. Go Eivor, anyway. Uh, ready? Yep. Good like a fun, good like a fun, buddy. One on five, seems fine. For Jeebus Gang? Did you get hit by one of those rocks in your head? <laughs> no, I wasn't out of my home even, Feral. I'll have you know. So, ready. Meet you, Lamo. Uh, will we have the casino pool? Wait, that's a casino pool. Uh, Euphredan. It's not as bad in Jeebus King as it is in some other variants, but, uh... <coughs> oh, wait, this is unacceptable. I think if I close this, and I... Nah, come on, not in a tournament match. Nah, but I... Yeah. Can you not blink? Mm. Oh. <sighs> And so it begins. And so it begins. Thank you, Askin. Holy. <laughs> I see. Wow. 1725. How generous. Oh, that's what you mean. <laughs> Lol. Uh, do this. Oh, uh, where's the bet? Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's do a prediction. Uh, prediction, start prediction, we'll actually win, you yeah, have five minutes, ENJOY! Hmm... Five? Yeah, because we started the game, I don't really want to, uh, want you to see faster resets or anything like that. <laughs> wow, the challenge was accepted. R.I.P. Hmm... Thank you, Beryl, hell yeah. Uh, what is the format? Uh, I should ask him, KC. I bet he's gonna be popping in at some point, okay? And I'm pretty sure he made a command for this. Probably. So, yeah. The command is like a pretty simple bracket. Uh, a tournament bracket, you know? Um, this tournament is also by NKC. Um, this is his template, his precious. Um, and that's where we play. Let it gain! I, I, I am, but don't bully. I, I, I am of many business. Kind of. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> Not often. <laughs> but but this time for real, okay? Yo, I'm Kissy. Uh, do you have a command uh, with a link to the tournament? <laughs> the prediction is not available to viewers in your region. Ha <laughs> ha. We bully because you called me Gob Girl. <laughs> I did! I did! I meant it. <laughs> That's the best part about it. <laughs> Is it? Mm. Oh, you baby. Might as well finish goal. Might as well finish goal. Thank you, Tufla. Hell yeah. Go, go, go. We're going, Rishi. Your favorite hero appeared. Oh, yeah, Alkin. Yeah, Alkin is amazing. But this biome is like pretty tragic, I think. We have like no breathing room. We can't actually move anywhere. So, uh, we're kinda... This is very claustrophobic. I don't really like this at all. Not to mention when we have Euphidon, so we don't really have an army either. So... There's many things going against this map. Sure, but why girl? Cause Emo and Goth usually more associates me, uh, to me with girl. So I just, you know, went with the flow. Goal complete, close stream. Imagine! <laughs> Imagine though. <laughs> <laughs> you 
You better lose this. I bet 1k for this. Okay. I will uh, most definitely win this. You're going bankrupt. But, like, the roads are pretty tragic and also starting army is tragic. I don't see, really see me being able to temple out here. <coughs> okay. Thank you, MKC. Wait, then let's do title. Then let's do change it to... Let's change this. <coughs> um, <clears throat> difference uh, to King is the fact that it's way high tempo. Uh, what this ends up meaning is the fact that... Um, yeah, what it ends up meaning is that uh, most of the boxes are actually really, really good. They're either experienced or army, so they're consistently good. Most of the bad artists are removed, so you always, almost always get good artists from Black Power, Shared Shots, and so on. So most of the things that you do end up actually being rewarded almost every single time, um, leading to a faster playstyle of the game. Um, also, there are more roads that you can farm because there's actually four towns in your volume. And also, everybody in the desert also gets a town each. Um, at the at every single break, there's gonna be a town for both players. Well, for all four of the biomes, I guess. By the way, I have a shield and I have a sword. My mindsets are gonna be insane here. So yeah, it is a very high tempo Jeebus. There's also a, a, a very certain amount of objects in every single biome, making it so you don't really get screwed with zero hives, uh, the or consoles or whatever. The most important part, though, is the positioning and how early and well you can actually start doing them. At least in my opinion. Uh, what I'm currently saying is very, very subjective. I might not be representing the wills of the offer. So, you know, I'm just giving you my interpretation of it. So it's like Jeepus Outcast, but in GC setting. Uh, Jeepus Outcast is also a creation of MKC. And it was edited atop of Jeepus King. So basically... There was Jeebus Cross first, then Jeebus King well, was made by MKC, and then Jeebus King was edited to be Jeebus Outcast at some point. Um, so basically Jeebus Outcast is not a variant of Jeebus Cross, it's a variant of Jeebus King, actually. I just say Jeebus, uh, Jeebus Cross uh, because it's easier to explain. I have a... Uh... Okay, let's see. I should probably start clearing the roadblocks, and I should not be sending all the heroes out to the other side, just because it's a little bit more convenient to deal. That's not a really good idea. Let's actually start playing seriously. This is a tournament match that I really want to win. <clears throat> so, it's, so since it's high tempo, it's not suited for Feral. Damn. <laughs> Damn. <clears throat> You're not invited. Well, considering how rude he's been, I, I'm not very surprised. So then, um, we're looking to be able to farm the My Tartis as soon as possible. The moment that we farm the My Tartis, we every single side here is going to be strong enough to do even big fights. Um, to get those, we actually can't even need Grandos, but Grandos are only coming day free. So actually, we're like a little bit delayed in getting the pop off. Uh, but that's really, really good in the sense that we actually have Center Captains, which will be fast, which will be making every single hero that I have fast. Uh, what this means is that the moment that we do start farming, we'll be able to farm almost the entire map in a single turn. That is an exaggeration, um, but yet anyway, it's actually not a big exaggeration, so that is the good part. Oh, uh, free shops. Yeah, but shops are like a very bad object to start on. They are hard, very, very hard uh, compared to what their rewards usually are. Yo, Hubel. I have Brockhill. Brockhill is pretty cool, but I still probably would like the main Eivor. I mean, I probably don't really want to, um, like, stick, uh, I mean, latch on to one main, like, a little bit too much. And yeah, two shops north, one uh, here. Hmm. Shops will be maybe closing me into, like, top uh, zone. You're the best player in your chair. When Cat is not around, then yeah. I currently still don't know where uh, some of my easy objects are in the map. Meaning that it's not going to be very easy to get this map started. I also don't see any of the boxes yet either. Um, so yeah. 
Uh, what I mean to say by this is the fact that we are looking to solve a few of my issues still. I'm cringe and decided to not sign in. Jesus. Well, yeah, <laughs> it didn't feel like that, huh? I probably want to get my main over here. We see two of the consoles in their own row that's available again. Upon resets, okay. Hey, Severe. Uh, 17 4. This is 3 3. That's pretty good. I really like the army roll. The fact that I have one roll so far is not very appealing, though. I don't want to commit to either elves or centaurs quite yet, so I'm just gonna move Ares out like this. I also don't really want to collect too much gold on this euro, because I want to be able to see more of the map so I can make a better decision of what I want to do in terms of my first day build. So we move. Okay, does this actually influence my first turn build at all? I think it does. I feel like I can do this. I should be able to do this fight. What time is opponent? The opponent is playing Inferno. He rolls Ignatius. Um, Ignatius makes a lot of sense for Jeebus King especially. Even I would roll Ignatius um, in Jeebus King, despite really, really loving um, Cal. So, on the first day of Jeebus. <clears throat> Damn, we're getting Christmasy already. Calm down. In case he gave to me. Undeable black power. Wow, okay. Uh, what is special about Jeebus King? Lots of tempo, consistent maps. Um, so yeah. Uh, that's what's special about Jeebus. That's a very nice way to ask the question, Olay. Um, when somebody asks, like, what's the difference? Well, there's so many differences, then it's pretty hard to explain. But when you ask it like this, it's very easy to explain. Um, the way that the tempo is emphasized is by giving every single player in every single time a certain number of objects that you can most certainly find at some point in the match. Also making most of the outcomes for some of the other objects so more consistent as well. By removing some of the bad arties, uh, you are more likely to get a consistently good one as well. So most of the things have more reliable outcomes, leading to higher tempo games. So what do I do? Uh, what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? I should scout the rows, I should set up the center stables over there. I'm not really sure about the hill for it. It's really, really good, but utilizing it is pretty expensive and hard. Hmm. I'll actually send Ivor out. I'll keep Curious main for now. That's because this is birthday. Bro! It, it, it's not birthday. <laughs> okay. We have another hero that can move out with his own unit. Who would be the hero to farm this, though? Uh, the council's in your biome? Yeah, it surely is. I just have to walk like this, right? Clear the beholders and walk. Oh, uh, pretty good one, actually. Certainly enjoy having that. Ooh, this is actually day two if, if I go elves. Happy anniversary in Happy your Happy anniversary birth. of your birth. In days. I'm too lazy to count, but thank you, Josh. <laughs> I hope you had the best birthday ever. Whenever it's gonna come, or whichever birthday you mean, I hope so too. But it's not my birthday today, so it is what it is. Alkin! We have a main. Okay, now that we have a turbo main, we might just want to commit to keeping this. There's not much going on, and it's probably worse on my first map. But the first map I kind of discarded in my play, so that one doesn't really count. I mean, it counts, but... Not, not like, mentally. <laughs> hey, Chai. What are the trade, if you don't mind me asking? Don't mind at all. I got paid 1k to play my blue rampy versus this red inferno. Road suck. Do they? I feel like there's gonna be a town next to my break, and isn't that like a very good thing? I wouldn't be so quick to call that. Not to mention, uh, most of the generations of Jeebus King Rose, and don't end up being that good. 
Uh, what I mean by that is that the standard for keeping is lower than the normal Jeepers Cross, isn't it? We don't have to find the perfect rows because we're both going to be playing at the same level, uh, playing field with below average rows, right? And that's fine. Have a happy normal day of heroes, like so. Why, thank you, Chelsea. Um, okay. Man, this actually is a pretty weak start. I'm not really setting up anything. I'm not doing anything. Nah, maybe this is a reset. Oh, by the way, I didn't buy my side armor, love. Yeah, lol. It's Necro again. Hmm, okay, this, this break skills it. I'll actually... One on one. Or, ah! <clears throat> Are the horses still running strange like the other day? Yeah, yeah, it is right enough. And I'm playing a tournament match, so I don't really want to be... Um, handicapping myself with these zero moments, so we're playing on fast mode to give respect to the tournament and the opposing player. I have a lot of elves, but I don't have any Santa. Seems like a pretty Santa, I mean, elf style game. That's a really good early boss, and that's probably a day two boss. Uh, those would be too risky on no resets on day one. Could easily be 49. I would be blocking this road, so... We don't want to move that hero yet. I'll check the size out. Okay. Now I know that I don't have to get the army over there, since, you know, I can't really do that. Ooh, homestead. Okay. So, the elf count early on is gonna be, like, really, really good. We have a few hives as well that I could do early, especially if I end up getting one of these boxes to be army boxes, which is kind of likely in some place, so that's pretty cool. Uh, there's a sword over here. We have a chess piece. Uh, the only time we uh, we are not winning is when Lexi suicide. <laughs> That's quite a bit of done winning situations right there that you described, Sufla. <laughs> <laughs> or maybe you could say it that I suicide every single time that I'm not winning. You see, that that's also like a way to see it, and that paints me in a much more negative light. I don't really think that's the case. Um, like most of the time, but you know, it kind of do be like that. Success or death? Could be a mentality deal. Do you piece both the sharpshooter? Yeah, but it's the same piece, so... Oh wait, no, it actually is not. We're only missing both the love and chair wood for that. Oh, uh, Gurney's pretty cool. I want to go here in this direction, but I want to leave first on my e-boy. I want them to collect the XP. Is that the case? I'm not so sure anymore. Hmm. Where can Eros go? Eros can do nothing anymore. On day one, at least. There's gold over here, but I'm not really able to reach it. I want to buy L's immediately, but I don't really feel like I can afford it. Hmm. I think I know what I do. Lexi made this, uh, makes the description of himself and doesn't consult the uh, chat. Just like when he deliberately left his army at the base when facing <laughs> Feral and Jeeva's outcasts. Uh, I didn't have to get that one in mind to me. Ah, shit, I lost against Feral and Jeeva's outcasts. <laughs> ah, damn. It's all coming back to me. <laughs> <clears throat> Everything's wearing white socks uh, and, well, and sandals with katana under the desk. Hmm. Am I though? Um. Hmm. I think this is. No, this wasn't okay. Yikes. Yeah, wait, I lost six against that. Damn, that's pretty bad. Mm-hmm. Sick. Howdy but we're going Grandy's next turn anyway. But, yeah, sure, that's fine. Um, I appreciate all Thank you. 
There's Hex 6 and now there's Kex 5. Is there any connection, I wonder? <laughs> Actually, I 6 or start only. Nah, it's kind of horrible, but I wasn't able to reach too much gold and the Black Tower ended up being too big. I could have just not invested in Tails in the one. I wasn't taking any hard fights anyway. None. Gotcha. I want to be placing this one over here. Or he wants you to believe that. Well, he's pretty successful in, you know, fulfilling his wishes. Unlike some people ask him. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. <laughs> Unlike me getting back to high rating, I guess, right? Well, no, I was 650 like a few days ago. Wait, what happened? Damn. Um, anyway. Now this is the end of this turn. I'm... I don't know, I'm kind of indifferent on opponent resetting or not. Good luck, good luck, okay. Uh, good luck have fun, Misia. Is there a prize for the winner? winner? Uh, yes, there is. Uh, details can be found uh, on the tournament page. Along with the bracket, who's participating, there's plenty of big names, especially in the Jupiter's King scene. All of that is pretty cool. Golden Bow. Oh, I'm not too interested in Golden Bow. Okay. So I'm definitely changing the army over here to claim probably the Unicorn Glade, to claim this. There's quite a bit that I want to do here still. I also need some gold, actually. <coughs> Wait, I can actually just push the north with the elves. Is that ever an idea? It's sometimes an idea, but it's a pretty bad idea nonetheless. Um, this is 760 plus... No, it doesn't reach. Aeris will have to connect. Wait, Aeris can connect. Just by picking up the wood, right? Yes, okay, cool. Um, as long as that connects, we're fine. This buying will be hard to chain out. Yeah, yeah. So, for now, Homestead. <coughs> Upgrado. Man, the, the Santa's being a different size does suck, but should be fine, I guess. Probably doesn't suck too much. We want brown Santa's to be one size, since they move first, so they can take the retail for both of the other size. Two strings. Uh, yep. Uh, here, here, here. That seems good. Thank you. No, 35 battle Boshki. Okay. Man, there's so many different stocks of the army. That's not very convenient to play around with. Uh, but sure. By the way, I don't have to commit on the uh, Eivor being main. Pretty much anybody this match can be main still. Okay, so what I think I should do is I should scout this out. Ooh, ramp. Ooh, that's a re- Oh, I want to get my army there. Like, get the ramp in me, get the hive immediately. No, but then again, at the same time, there's no rush to do that. I don't gain a lot by doing that immediately, rather than possibly next turn, for example. Oh, that's pretty bad. Well, I mean, not that bad. We have a shield on the road, that's really, really good. A long game ahead. Usually, Jeeves King games are really kind of a blowout. Well, actually, they can go long as well. They go in that direction. By the way, we're playing a best of three here. Um, It's not a single match, but I don't currently indicate that in the title. So fast here today. I ended up uh, bleeding, and when the bleeding began, I couldn't close the wound, and I just bled out. I blood out everything I had, okay? <laughs> it was not a very enjoyable experience. <laughs> I should keep this over here. Homestead Golden Bow is cool. We're one away from Bow the Sharpshade, I thought it would be more exciting. 
Um, step back onto here. We are currently overkilling with moves, so we may as well pick this up. That seems fine. Start building power. Power, not as in power, but power. Trust me, I know what I'm saying. Probably. I don't exactly want to fight these. But I might have... No, actually, I might have wanted to fight them. If I could upgrade these centaurs, then the biggest would be really, really easy. Not power just stack. No, I'm not talking about units. I'm talking about, like, just a collection of artifacts that would make any single hero that were to take a fight powerful. Uh, powerful not in terms of power, but in terms of actual fighting power. <laughs> not power, but power, okay? Like, you understand, right? <laughs> Ooh, box. Cool. <laughs> Look at this army though. Ah, but they're like so split. It's kind of hard to utilize them. I want to go here in this direction and scout out a little bit. Oh, do I want to do this immediately? Probably do. Uh, doing it this turn and next turn is actually zero difference. And I also might want to get the Shield of Naval Glory. Or maybe a Minicons. Okay. I mean, Minicons is actually not the best outcome, but... In case I do have a mini console, doing it immediately is the best way to handle this not ideal outcome, I would say. So we do it immediately. This is gonna be my first temple start. The next time I'm getting shield, I'm getting the hive, then I'm pushing north, I'm getting the other hive, I'm getting the other meat, I'm upgrading all the centaurs, I'm turning to the right side down. Uh, but up until I'll have all the towns and most of the vision in my biome. Off of that, I'll be able to make uh, pretty much the entirety of the rest of the plan that I need to actually break out of the biome and have a good game. So, yeah, do me like that. Can you make it there? Oh, you can. Wow, you're you're a fast boy, aren't you? <clears throat> yeah, Shimsa. Power is power, Castle Lannister. I haven't heard a man be so wrong my entire life. Lesha 2020. I probably would rather hit than get hit, I guess. I was protected by two Nokia phones. <laughs> Nokia phones are pretty small, they're one stacks. I mean, they're one hex units, so they, they don't easily protect them. I would be lying if I knew I... I would be lying if I knew I... If I said I knew what I was talking about. Okay, so I think I should be able to take the picket off of this still. I'll be able to take this, 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 upgrade, this, meet, meet. Uh, then I use this guy to chain forward in this direction. There's another console here, that's amazing. I need far more gold to actually um, manage all the chains that I want to do. I'll also have to farm more banks as well. For example, the old one treasure over here seems like a really, really good thing to go for. We get gold though, it doesn't do anything. It's a pretty bad artifact for PvE. It's really, really good for PvE in the final battles, but it's not very good for PvE. So I don't think, really think it's worth my attention that much here, right now. That's about GG. Unless he has insane volume as well. It's a Jeeves King match. It is very likely that he's gonna be having an insane volume as well. <clears throat> oh, we played Jeeves King. Uh, yep. This is a Jeebus King tournament. No problem. So, what do we do? Uh, first of all, we can get our Eivor out. No, actually, do we want them out? Uh, okay, think about my next turn's chain a little bit more. I need to actually figure this out. Okay, so what would I ideally do? I would like the treasury, the, the shield, the fly hive, the treasury, the picket, the treasury, the Crypt, the Unicorn Glade, the Hive, the Hive, the Treasury, the Churchyard, the ho Homestead. Also, I forgot to mention the Upgrade. Um, I want to get this down. Um, off of this down, I want to get the Hive, I want to get the Black Tower, I want to get the Army to Sandro. Then the Sandro should get the Newtown, and then play farm everything around it. That's, that should be my next turn. 
Uh, feasible? Question mark. Uh, first of all, I don't think actually this chain connects from this side because using the moon points over here north and then the hive is probably gonna lead me to be about here. And then there's other things I want to farm, so I should probably get another hero out. Um, I would like to get some of the meat from this town as well, but I can't. Also, this doesn't, I didn't make the hero faster, I just make myself feel a little bit better. Yeah, what now, Sandro? Your move. Mm, okay, first of all, I should get this guy back on the road a little bit more, so he's more connected. Connectable, whatever. Because the goal here is the treasury and this, I feel like getting this guy here out is fine. For the best 420 percentage. <laughs> Wait, damn, I... Hmm... Wait, the, would, would that make 420 percentage 69? Damn. <laughs> Classy. Uh, okay, so we have a lot to do this turn, so let's start doing it immediately. I want to be having these guys in the middle, these guys here, these guys here. No, these guys here. Then we're going to be starting off by hitting the bottom left immediately with everything. Uh, no, we should do it like this. Yes, that's better. These guys should not be left to dead, though. No, not left for death, though. Something like this will do. 69, 69, you're welcome. Wow. <laughs> This is what your dragon game vlog made me do. <laughs> uh, it's not that I missed that game though. Yeah. It was something. Mm, yeah, so this is the way that we do to treasury. Angel hits and then everybody else connects. Uh, should we hit on this train? Mm, no. I'll actually bait this guy back. Uh, set the rest of the folk up like this. Okay, that actually works. Mm -hmm. Then we're having on the next turn. Um, no, actually we can hit here, hit here. Now we hit, hit, wait, hit, wait, wait. And now we can just auto finish. There we go. No losses for a big treasury, that's pretty cool. Cassiope is actually building into a pretty good hero as well. I'm not sure if I'll end up actually utilizing that, but having the fact be a thing is still pretty nice. Um, there we go. Did you see the game actually in YouTube, Elizabeth? I mean, you say you missed it, but you still know. Do you actually check the VOD, or rather, did you check it out on YouTube? Just curious. Oh, we can't connect here. Oof. Ooh, wait, that's kind of bad. Okay. Uh, quite a few of the, the, quite a few of those were lost. More than I would have expected, but okay. Our right, satline is looking pretty good. Should have taken that five for XP for my actually one of my best heroes by now. We go like so. It's a pretty big one. Ooh, damn, that's a big one, and we didn't even lose those. Yeah, that's amazing. Let's take that. Now we have twelve vibrants, lol. <laughs> yeah, we just have twelve vibrants, lol. Another big treasury, this will supply me with more gold to actually be able to do most of the things that I want to do. That is amazing. Have these guys in the middle, have these guys here. No, these guys here. Yeah, that's good. Mm, then we should... Oh, I made a mistake. Okay, then I had to lose something, then the auto looks appealing. Because I wasn't able to prevent both of them from hitting immediately on turn 1. Which means that my result there wouldn't have been good almost no matter what. Which means that we should probably just take the auto. That's all I that's all I think is. Mm, right now I don't really want to do the... Because I ended up losing my center captains into the big uh, hive, I cannot really control the picket fight anymore that well. So I'll be skipping the picket and I'll be doing it when I have like more angels or more of some other types of army.
How do you not watch Yeah, I take that pot, that high fight? I literally place myself with the, uh, by placing my L's over here and then uh, abusable stacks over here and here. It is a very common placement in order to preserve your L's. I pretty much know how the Yai does it because I do it all the time, right? So I'm not that intrigued. What I'm saying is that you're a scrub. I don't mean it though. Tasting the Fetziak. <clears throat> I'm gonna be skipping the script for the sake of more movement. Yawn. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know, I know. I'm gonna be losing some else here, but losing else is fine. Ooh, wait, I really want the sword. Can I take it on the same turn? Hmm. I'm not sure the chain can is properly. Is this Echo Chop? Wait, I don't know if that is Echo Chop range. No, it's not. Okay, that is kind of whatever. Yeah, I'm still connecting the chain, I think. Even if I pick up the sword. Okay, so now all my heroes will be with really good army. I also want to split these guys so they're more likely to get focused by the flies. Yeah, did you? Then army back to crossroad. Getting a Tivor is like a big expense. Uh huh. So what do I do now? There's still plenty of heroes that are important. Eris is gonna be able to help on the picket over here. Cult is gonna come to the to South Town. I think that Gurney is like one of my worst heroes right now. So I might want to have him be the one to lead it, but he's also collecting the most gold. But then again, I'm farming like massive banks by now, so it's kind of fine. Small dance game. I know, right? Okay, so we take the army. Maybe I have attacked this hero next. That would be really, really good. Okay, so I guess I'm not really upgrading the... I'm not really upgrading the uh, Sentos anymore, because I really don't have any to upgrade. I also see Alkan in the tavern, which is kind of interesting. It might not be too late to build one, if we like get the fork down and it has like a box next to it. And we can just feed it to Alkan. And that would be pretty cool. Uh, I'm blocking the Sentos from taking the street now. That's not good. I guess we should shoot it as much as possible. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, there we go. Honestly, Cassiopeia might be in the main. I didn't mean to lose those walls up there, that's insane. Uh, we want to split them in like three, then put them here and here. Small again. Okay, maybe Eivor does have some redeeming qualities. <clears throat> this place is such. Uh, this means that I should play in this kind of way. Here. 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 Basically I'm just hacking one out. One dwarf, but that's it. Should not really have any more losses than that. What faction is the opponent? The opponent is playing in Inferno. Can you step inside? You can. Okay. So what I should do is I should trade to this one. Uh, I do not have the I do not have the moves to pick up the feathers. So yeah. Uh, I want to trigger the chain because I want the option to buy Alkin somewhere more useful. Anything else that I want to do from this town? I could build Dendroids or Pegasi. Pegasi would be kind of cool. It would help a lot with any picket that I would like to farm potentially. Hmm. Yeah, but not really sure about that. I should buy the last of the dwarves. I might just want the mage kill. 
Nah, you'll want the main shield in this stand, because that's where we're from. I'm running to do break. Honestly, Cassiopeia's probably breaking next turn, I think. Yeah, I think Cassiopeia's breaking next turn. Hmm. In that case, buying a little bit of tempo seems like a decent idea. I don't really see any better line. Then yeah, we get it up over here. The army that is. I can actually build up Rallon to be a decent hero too. But no, no, no. Not now. Maybe a little bit later. Then I should pick up the extra meat. Uh, now that I'm here and I'm buying he another hero here every single time, I can actually leave the elves and actually save them, at least for once in my life. <clears throat> yeah, I'm pretty sure that Cassiopeia is breaking next turn. Or I'm setting up full moves on 5, one or the other. That assumes fine. If I hit like this, they're not able to access the important units. Or the less discardable units. <laughs> Out of way, will do. Uh, there we go. Now I need another hero slot. So, hmm, Gem is like pretty slow, and also she doesn't really connect any vital piece of the biome, so need a leader. Next up on the list is Ain. I'll keep Rowan like this, I think. I might lead him actually, so I might not want to leave this, but I'll keep my options open. Uh, Gold Dragon. If I do it like this, actually I only lose a few dwarves. Hmm. I was wrong. I'll go further. Hill Fort is somewhat interesting. I also like the helmet over there. So, if I'm breaking next turn, then I should be looking to be as powerful as I possibly could be. Um, to make that happen, I'm gonna be able to take the Kansa. The Kansa will then allow me to take every single picket that I have in the zone. It's gonna be the picket over there, it's gonna be the picket, um... Wait, I had two pickets, right? This one and this one. Um, but right now there's actually something else that I really, really wanna do. And here is what it's gonna be. Okay, we're gonna take the Derek. Uh, Derek has more moves than Elkin, that's why I prefer him in this case. Saving else. Well... It's only a few else, man. It's fine. There's a third at the bottom left. No, no, no. I think we're taking that one into account, aren't we? Uh, like one and two. Oh yeah, here. This one. This one. This one. This one. Hi, how's game? Yokish, I think we're doing pretty well for now. Is it free? We have farmed pretty much most of our map. We still want the helmet. What else do we want? We want more actual heroes. I'm not sure what to do on main. I mean, anyone can be main. It doesn't really matter. Maybe we can just... Uh, are there prison heroes in this template? I'm pretty sure they are, right? And they're like pretty relevant to you. Lots of some weaklings. There we go. Hey, Apophis. Well, about Poshki, that's a pretty good outcome, I think. Um, but I'm missing... There should be, I think, two more consoles in the biome. I would really love to find those. I should probably sack some heroes in order to scout. Uh, what are some of the cycle heroes? I really want Ares to be a thing, so I can get the picket over here. I might want to get the tunic next turn. I will definitely get the crown. I want to scout a little bit over here. Mm. I want to scout, but I only want to scout zones that I would be able to farm on the next turn if I were to find something good there, you know? If I would scout something, but I wouldn't be able to take it anyway, even if I did find it, then there's actually not really much of a point to scout them in the first place. A game's playing, uh, a game's played back to back. I don't think it's necessarily played back to back, but I would like to be so. So if the opponent is okay with it, then we'll probably roll with it. Okay, so that's really good. 
I have a Ghost Rank break, which is very awesomely done by the Cassiopeia with their tactics, so it's a pretty well-fitting break for the kind of situation that I have. I'll be able to pick up the shop over here, the cons over here. Derek is gonna be like a really good hero for the cons of you, since I built them up to be to have like some offense, a little bit of that, you know, very good stuff. I can't even access uh, this side, so this is not really relevant to me. There might be some objects over there that I really will want to pick up, but I'll do it like during the actual turn. I'll pick up the Nagabank on the way back, I'll pick up this. I'm not sure about that Nagabank, I'm not sure about the mana st uh, the string. I should do my best to pick up the Angel Feather Arrows. I should look to build up the Eivor. Maybe I want another hero to set up here. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. No, two or three consoles in 2865. Oh, okay, thank you, Andrahanas. So, yeah. It's guys. It, it, it's like end game, Jiva. I mean, day four in Jiva's King, I think, is end game, and it's Gogs. Gogs. Okay. Well, he probably can will farm everything like in a single turn as I do right now. But okay, okay. Well, Gogs, Monkey Giga. Yes. I'm pretty sure what I just thought of is the case, right? Probably. He's like, yeah, boy, this, my opponent's that guy that always suicides, right? Easy. Easy, Tony. No, no, no. I mean, whatever. This doesn't influence me at all. We should play properly as we should. Yogs. Hmm. Uh, Angel should head to here to minimize the damage done by these guys. Then the top left stack will be hit by the Vibrance. Uh, the Pegasi should do their best to survive. And Pegasi are. Higher in priority list or survival compared to elves, even. I do think these guys should hit, these guys should bait, um, angels should hit immediately. These guys are dead. Enjoy being dead. Probably won't. That's the plan. Sorry for spoilers. Uh, will Wyvern survive one hit? I think it would. It would, nice. Uh, That's a really good outcome. For now I should bait this big stack in, and I should pedal down the other stack in other ways. Then we go. Then we go. There we go. Uh, pretty good outcome. Howdy, I don't really care about logs on the zero right now. Howdy, hmm. Alpha Tom, I appreciate all thank you! Dare cross smelled Warhammer. I'm a witch doctor. Okay, boy stuff. Whatever the witch doctor has to say to me, I'll uh, address it at a later notice, okay? Hmm. So right now we pick up the army off of Vayne. We get it to crossroads. Well, actually, we could probably get it to Striker immediately. We should save gold for like further chaining as well. I'm not sure if I want this box immediately or a little bit later. Yeah, Lucifer. Then what else is there? I need I need to delete a hero. And unfortunately, the only deletable hero right now is Derek. Despite him being good, um, he's not good enough to survive the deletion. Any cat does a good belly rub, especially my ones. That is correct, factual. That is the first factual statement I've ever heard you make. <laughs> no hate. <laughs> hmm. Here, 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 here. Yeah, that's good. Uh We saw the shield. We did see the shield. We are actually just one away. Hmm. And this could be it. 
This could be it. Uh, but now I can delete the heroes and the background, the shame. We should use the free angels and the RPs to claim the big dragon without losses. Well, <laughs> without losses, though. I'm pretty sure he's gonna delete us, so I may as well leave him on a unit like that. Mm, I guess we pick up the Alcan. No, I'm not really utilizing him that well, but that's okay. I think I'll be wanting the Mage Guild for the e boy. I'll also leave this for the uh, Eivor as well, as well as one of these guys. So yeah. Eivor is gonna be chilling for mana. <laughs> I probably want to fight this fight. Getting maybe like a little bit of extra armor for the... Potentially big picket would help. Uh, here, here, here. That's fine. Small, but unfortunate. Oh, but I'm not doing the shop in this case. Ah, uh, that's not too good. is not too bad either, though. It's fine. Uh, okay, wait. This is the placement, this is the placement, that is the placement. Yeah, that's fine. That's good. I might want to pick up just a few unicorns, just for the sake of me. The assert dominance, indeed. They did a good job at it, okay? Nobody can tell me otherwise. Oh, Fatum! Appreciate your fall, thank you! Well, I think I deleted my chain. But then again, I I presumably don't need a chain, but I should have the, op um, the option to have it anyway. <laughs> Shit. Okay, why am I starting to play bad? Just, just stop playing bad. What is this? Oh, the zero still connects. No, 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 the zero doesn't need to connect. Um, it's fine. The other three. I want to scout it here a little bit. Uh, we have a hive. And a utopia. So I could break full moves next turn. But I would have to have more support for that play. Currently all I'm doing is for picking up an extra hive for the sake of that. That's not good enough. I would rather break this turn. <laughs> this is very easy mode, unfortunately, because it's small. Thanks for the video on YouTube, I could uh, feel the pain again. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Yes, indeed. Mm hmm. What do I use for this fight? Uh, because it's like a single dwelling with nothing else but just the Cyclops and the other stuff, I'm pretty sure this should be able to handle it pretty easily. Pretty easily. Yo, yeah, NSK, Sunray. Yes, indeed. Oh, uh, forward again, easy. This time at least it's not a mini, so... This is my final setup before the break. And now we go ahead and we break. Average 104 break full moves. It's not full moves, but it's probably good enough to get the Desi Town. Which will lead me having Midtown, 1 and 5, possibly. Uh, I'm not that strong. 
Well, that's often. Six for attack there. Settled you. Auto losers. Not very good. Um, is this exploitable terrain? I wonder. Let's see. We could have this here, this here, and this here, and that's it. And then three of the stacks attack me. That's the same as having a top left. I can prevent one of the attacks, like this. Uh, no, I don't think that's good. Oh, that's not even guts in the fits, yeah? What do you mean? Wait, what about- Oh wait, what if I do it like this? Then one of the stacks can be here. No, then two stacks attack me at a time. That's better. Yeah, that's better. Then the unicorns are food. Oh wait, I can actually have my dwarves over here too. That's even better. Bottom? Um, let's see. How would this end up looking? I would probably want it here, so there's only one access point over here. There's only one access point over here. Yeah, then there's one here, one here. And that can put up another one stack, and then the unicorn actually suits some kind of purpose, at least for a little while. Uh, something like this, yeah? Then all you have to do is write and not get age. If I don't get age, it's probably gonna go pretty fine. Five, one, two, change, five. A fuck on! You push yourself, thank you, hell yeah! Uh, Grand is in front of webs. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Oh my god, I have to undo everything. <laughs> oh my god, why stack this off a Vega? What the fuck? Mmm, Saj. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think this is it. Okay. Oh wait, no, they all did nothing. Eh, whatever. We can actually like walk out as well if we want to. I probably hit here, otherwise I would just go to retail and then it would hit me anyway. I mean, I'd be getting more chances to get uh... Wait, I actually don't have timer, I should play faster. Not too fast, but faster. Oh, I thought I was taking the retail with the dwarves for the angels to hit, but I was wrong. That's not what happened at all. Sick. Yeah, good fight, good fight. Considering what the break was, that went pretty well, I think. Nice, we can make it. Uh, then I might just want to have Eivor push them in. Oh. Um. No, I want him to recover mana. Yeah, I want him to be main. Uh, so we give him a spell book, we give him the hat, we give him the pegasi, and he's gonna be main. Then we get this. Wait, no, not yet, not yet, not yet. Uh, for now we just move. What is this? Bone dragons? Okay. I'm pretty sure I can push with my army and I'll be fine. Uh, this is fine. This is bad. Mm, you can just chill. Well, you don't really have a choice but chill. Oh, but I really would like to push there as well. Okay, I think I know what I do. I have to have a few more heroes here. Yeah? I'll push down for the console. I think that angels are just sweet again. The best up on ever. I remember seeing Phantom's games where he has like a pack of angels from the biome. What am I remembering? Specifically castle games or like another version? Because if there's only up to three consoles in the biome, then that can't really happen, can it? Uh, okay. Then what I want to do is I want to take away everything but one angel. And the gloves, actually. And I want you to push. I want to be making absolutely sure I reach the mid down next turn, but then also I want to do another thing. Uh, first of all, I think that the gunner here is pointless. I'm not really pushing about the high back, I think. I don't have the timer to set up like too much by now. I have to do like pretty simplistic things. Just for the sake of them. Oh my god, this is pretty huge. Nice, nice, nice. That's a very good find. 
So Rosh then will be able to pick up the Kansa, pick up the Wayfair Boots, that's really amazing. Then we'll be able to push with the Avashias, we'll be able to buy my Cassiopeia book, we'll be able to borrow my Zivor back, since we have a book here as well. Do we have a... Um, slow? No, wait, well, we don't yet. Uh, I think I want to research. Nope. I can be Earth though. Got it. <laughs> nice. Wow. Such info, much wow. Uh, okay, so that's it, right? I'll buy a few marketplaces and I'll call it a day. How does Galo be slow? Oh, I see. Is this the one? Nope. I remember seeing that scream pop up, whatever. Okay, let's like calm down for a little bit. What are we doing? We could take the Utopia here? Nah, not really. I guess I'm pushing mid. <laughs> yeah. This is the last simultaneous turn. The opponent showing Vyvern. Not many stats. I have most of everything more even turns, of course, because I broke mid. Okay. Um, that'll do. Uh, I think you should be put inside. And you should be disqualified from life. Uh, best of three. <clears throat> uh, okay, don't have a lot of time here. Play faster, play faster, play faster. Oh, wait, that's good. Not that fast. Well. Mm, this will do. This will do. Uh, 5 12 stats should be able to carry me for the fights. That's pretty good. Uh, this guy is the one to move first. Uh, I'm not really sure how I'm hand handling that. We should wait, and then move. Unfortunately, the dwarf power stack is, um... How do I say it? Coming to an end, I guess. Um, now what I want to do is I want to get the army to Cassiopeia. Cassiopeia should pick up a book, which I can do after I get some wood. Um, off of that we can buy the ma Mage Guild, we can buy Cassiopeia book, the Mage Guild is atrocious, we get the slow anyway. <clears throat> and now we can do the fight over here. For the sake of the air town. Ashmer slow available, right? Yeah, it is. Let's go then. Eight! 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 Jesus. They actually had a one second instead of the eight. No, somewhat horrible. Nice. Uh, tend to help me out uh, quite a bit here, I think. If I'm not misunderstanding what happened. Um, army is like diminishing pretty rapidly. Can we do that fight? This would be an interesting fight video. Uh, I feel like it has a lot of potential for very good things. I got some leadership, right? I'll just have these be neat for me. This is be uh, fortress, man. So it has like a lot of potential to be good. Also, the auto loses. Yikes. No, this is like all spells. Wait, isn't this all spells literally 100% of the time? So maybe we should just leave this box after... After liberating it. This is all spells every time. Like, how every time? Like, how sure are you?
Here, here. Oh wait, not oh, I shouldn't have died, just the up there. Four. Um, in a fight bigger than uh, a break is spells. Okay, so I leave this box right now. It is all spells in the game. Minus 28 to uh, 5 waves. Well, yeah, we have 6 angels, we have the meat, we have like power by now. Uh, we are kind of fine. We need more levels and wisdom on the main. These bosses would have been amazing too. Okay, we push man. Push man, push man, push man. Nice here. Not nice. I refuse that outcome. Uh, what else do we have? We have chain lightning, but we're really low damage, so we don't really care too much. Uh, these don't really do. Well, actually, they do finish it off. Yeah, it's worth it. Number up on here, and then here. No, I don't do that. No, 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 I don't do that. Uh, the blow, yeah. Better shut down this noise. Nice, we got the mid down. That is rather amazing. I have the air book, so I can actually fly over to the to these guys as well. Uh, for now, we want to get our Ebor in men. But one to one army. Nah, 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 it's fine. This is 970 remaining. This is okay. So this is actually a better format. Also do it on a less costly unit. Uh-huh. We don't have a lot of power. I mean it's all bigger than the opponents. Okay, but now I have to find thing objectives to go for. I need like a few easy banks. Well, that's an easy bank. Mm -hmm. uh, this guy is connecting back to here. Uh, I think I don't need Ash though. Uh, what a sense. Uh, since are 1 to 5. So they're over, pretty much. Trying with 3 pounds, that's fine. I think I should be collecting some of these bosses. Immediately? Immediately. Uh, this is really good hero. She can four mans off of four. Uh, okay. So, we just start farming these on the Eovashias, I guess. We could DD over into this one. Nah, that's not a thing. I don't think I care about that. Next turn, we are recovering mana. Right? When in a mage guild. Are we defending the men? No, we're not. We don't. Well, then again, the fact that we don't have the info from the non centerns is pretty bad. Uh, we want to be equipping this and we want to be visioning so we can actually get a better sense of what's going on. Mm. The vision range is still available low. I kind of want to be pushing in the direction of my opponent though. If I can be. And currently I kinda can be. Nah, I want all these all of these boxes. I think that's what I go for. I just set up all on them pretty much immediately. Yup, Bubsy. Uh this guy can actually pick up all the spell box. Or maybe it's not a spell box. Nah, it's impossible for it to not be not be spell box, right? Ah, uh, this box over here messed me up a little bit too much. What than I expected, to be honest. Okay, I think I go for the simple objectives first. Don't try to make this too complicated. 
Also, my main my main might actually be the Gassio PS though. Uh, we have extra slow, we have a little bit of an army. Then there's gonna be a hive. Nice. Uh, this is six arch angels, they're not too high to deal. I feel like uh, the hive will actually be worth it. And I might be able to go into the utopia as well. Uh, and yeah, my, uh, my Cassiope is getting mana back. Uh, could actually be the main hero defending the town. Mm, I could maybe do the parries. Get some XP, get the wisdom, get the spells, and then defend. No, not enough mana for TP though. Um, any heroes in towns? No, no heroes in towns. Actually, I have British over here. Is there any more heroes that I want to have? No, not really. I have a llama over here, that's good. Yeah, that's about okay. <clears throat> Worst case scenario, the only thing, the only reason we're thinking that the timer ex uh, expired for the opponent, okay, it did expire, was because of uh, lobby lagging, but it seems like not. Damn, he lost his one sex, too. Yeah. That's kind of brutal for him. We have pretty similar heroes. Looks like GG time. Looks like it. <coughs> Rashka. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Play the game, play the game, play the game. Mm, first of all, I want to be... Uh, getting a new hero. No, I mean, I don't need a new hero. My Eovash is full deal. I want him to get the army, and I want him to push for the hive. He is pretty decent. I should have taken some more meat, though. Um, is that okay? I can ace one of them up. Lol. Yeah, that's okay. Oh, that's the... Wait, what is that? Oh, pen of second side. Oh, this actually confirms that this is not a quest side idea. Hmm. Right now it's still love to go. Okay, well... I think it'll be if I should suffer a horrible death. And this isn't horrible. Big box, I will, but like all in due time, okay? All in due time. We don't have slow here, that's fine. Keep on for not accepting auto. Escape. I can still possibly farm the toe. It's a small one. Yeah, I probably want to do it right now on the Evoy. Right now on the Evoy. But I do want to bring over more meat. Like at least one size. Did I maybe have a very fast hero? Uh, this guy is actually able to just take it. Yeah, okay, let's just take it. Mm -hmm. All spells in the game. Do I care about this guy? No, I don't. I should just kill him. BP? I, I don't have the moon points to do so. <clears throat> Imagine he fought those idols for like his entire life basically and this is how it went Okay, so there's still like plenty of things that I want to do Um 
Uh, thick meat. I'm gonna be winning off of stats on RPs, basically. That's my entire plan. Okay. Um, so here we go. One of these of an armory. Good. Doesn't matter too much. I think in this case. Nothing else to be used here, right? I can use these guys. It's not bad. Nice. Fine. Spellbinder is cool. Well, no, not cool. I would need mana to use that. I don't have the mana. I already had Dimension there. It's actually kind of worthless. Um, the rest of the stuff was also kind of worthless. I'm having second thoughts now. Hmm. On what? <clears throat> Is there any more creature bangs that I can find? Not really. I really want to get these boxes though. I think they're super important. Ah, uh, but I used up all the meat here. Oh shit, I would actually need to get, uh, change some more meat from somewhere else. Like from here. Can I do it? Uh, the biggest limit? This is 49 hydros or something. All spells. <clears throat> Yeah, I know. Oh, he does, doesn't he? For you, for me, 2k XP. I mean, it do be like that. Uh, okay, I need to get this meat right here. Ah, kill me. In time. In time. Ah, come on. Uh, Rashka should be kept alive. Uh, Velaska should die. Ah, then I have to kill this as well. Damn. I have to use my gold very efficiently, but that's fine. Um, this. Here. And it's fine. The side is not hard. Oh shit. Uh, like here, 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 here. I think this is how I do it. We should be hitting the same dragon with both stocks. But then we get AoE. No, 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 I don't hit. I don't want to get the AoE too much. Too horribly. Shit. I mean... Hmm. Whether it's worth it really does depend. But uh, we'll see. Minus 4 angels. Wisdom. XP. Final birds and XP. And final birds, okay. Then I'm only getting tier 3 spells. Unless I'm doing the top for XP. Uh, small one. Nine twelve expert offense, no casting. Would have to get equipped this. Um, shit. Does this defend actually against them? Does this actually defend against them? That's the problem. That's the question that I'm having. 400 from here, does that even torment? Here? 
here, here, here. Yeah, there's four mods. Okay, let's just pick up the up the tier three and whatever. Let's go. Uh, Anva, yes. Pick up. I think I need the boots. There's also another thing that I want to do. I want to get the other helmet back. Whoa. Helmet. Uh-huh. Uh, there should perish. Pretty bad it's for four angels. Um, yeah, probably worth it. I don't know. It's hard. If I got advanced offense, I mean advanced wisdom, then definitely worth it. Right now, it is like, it could be out of way. I need wood. Shit. Wait, um. Mage Guild? Hello? Mage Guild? Hello? Uh. Army? Yes, yes, yes. But like, Mage Guild is more important. Wood and gold, wood and gold. Yeah. I mean, this is fine. Um, how do I get wood? Could there be a new hero that could get me enough gold and wood? Um, okay, wait. I could sell two more of this, delete, uh, move out. Uh, this is a stack cleaner. In terms of moves. Um, then go. No, this does not make it. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm defending like this. Oops. Oh no, Artie's either. He has 4 mana. Oh my god, I would just- I can just slow and win. I mean, I could've slowed on one. Yay, my turn! What do you have? You're worthless. <clears throat> Uh, Ring of Life, are we close to the Elixir? We're not, right? We're not. Uh, this is the Mage Gold turn, okay? This is the Mage Gold turn. Mage Gold turn, this is. We need a guy here just so we can get the wood and get the wood and get more wood so I never run out of wood. The best wood is the Eternal. The wood that lasts forever. Us. Ah, yeah, that seems like a good item. Adelaide can be the hero to dismiss this one with the Bone of Fireball. Uh, you have visions? No. I could take the blocks here on the Cassie, but then she doesn't get mana back. But it's fine, because Evor's gonna be the one defending, I guess. Right? Right. Let's go. Uh, take the fight over here. A few gold dragons is not that problematic. And the DB very nice. Uh, that is incorrect. Um, air does nothing to help the DB. The D is good on its own, and air magic does nothing for it. Unless you're playing in an extra large plus underground or bigger template, then it can DD multiple times per day off the more DD, but this is not the case right now. Fuck, but whatever. 
better than the other result. We have an army! Damn, that's cool. <clears throat> what did you get? I got a Cyclop Kings. Do I go for the boxes here? Uh probably do. I can't get mana back then. Oh my god. Another turn without mana. Are you kidding me? We're probably getting attacked. Nah, like there's no way these two turns connect immediately, right? Like there's no way. Yeah, we go for the boxes. They didn't grab Tifa. Yeah, me on the- MANA! Not to mention it's like pretty heavily guarded. Oh, oh. To get mana, you need a mid you need a mage gold, bro. Well I don't have one! What the fucking do, huh? <laughs> Death white people happy. Yeah, deaf white people happy. But not for me. Why didn't you come up with a sword? Cause I'm tilted! Can't you see? I didn't equip a bit of chase beside her so I can actually sustain some spell cast, you know? I could have done that. Yeah. Our wee little person should have done that. Did I do that? No. Okay, okay. Calm down. Calm down. I'm fine. I find me that I didn't want to have him army anyway. Not bad. How many birds? <clears throat> I still have pretty good. But how many birds can a person have? Tell you have. Until you have too many birds. Dude! How fat is the stack? I wanna do calculator. I wanna do 48 times 60. It is like 14 angels big. The stack of birds. Oh my god, next time I'm still not getting the teapot. Like, how bad am I at this video game? Oh, hello. Wait, but I cannot do this. I need actual heroes! But damn, these, these are two pickets and shit. I mean, two consoles. Pickets, dance game. Okay, listen, this is for this is for eventual. This is, I'm, I'm taking that eventually, okay? And eventual is good enough. If you don't think so, then I don't disagree, but don't say that anyway. You will hurt my feelings. Am I fine? Am I okay? I mean, I'm not, not okay in the video game, but am I okay like... No, I mean, I know I'm not okay outside the video game, but am I okay, am I okay in the video game? Uh, okay, the game of the video seems to be okay. I'm fine. I have lots of birds. I have lots and lots of birds. I'm fine. Send a 20 hero mana there. No, I'm not taking this on the side here. Fuck that. I'm getting mana on my main, then I'm going here, then I'm the DD, then I'm farming. One of these, then I'm TPing back, then I'm getting the army back over to Seely, then Seely can actually take the other concept and get back. Okay, that is the plan. Thank you for listening. What do bears one shot everything? They do not! They, they literally do not. They do the damage of a dendroid. Do you think dendroids are gonna one shot things? Huh? I want to hear the answer to that. Do you think dendroids one-shot things? No, they actually deal the damage of a dendroid. It's like, because they're fast, you're like, damn, fast units usually deal damage, and you're usually correct, but usually you don't play fat birds, okay? So, no. If you have enough, yes. Well, do you think I have enough? The attack skill is so much higher. What? 
Yo, aren't you like factually incorrect? Hero 3, uh, Thunderbird. Uh, Hero 3, Dendroid. Okay, Dendroid has 9 attack. These guys have uh, 13 attack. You're literally physically correct. But but the Spike Force attack skill, who cares? Who cares, man? Nobody cares. <clears throat> and both hurt a lot. If they happen, have you ever seen a human play? Okay, listen, crack. Okay, I'm gonna riddle you a riddle. Have you ever, ever in the history of Heroes 3 seen a human player lightning bolt with a Thunderbird? It's actually propaganda. You never, as a human player, Thunderbolt. It's only for AI exclusively. Literally only AI exclusive feature. It's only there to uh, fuck you over. How much attack cycle pass? More than you need. House Thunderbolt damage is calculated for birds. Stand per bird. Easy. Uh, check it D. I think you dropped some vodka in there. I would be laying on the ground with vodka. Do I look like I'm laying on the ground right now? Propaganda like in Putlan. Yes. Same like we do for a basilisk. Uh, stoning chance. I know. Except that. It happens, meanwhile the Thunderbird doesn't happen. They want you to pick it 20%, but actually... A disjoint? Is that being toxic again? No. But I'm failing. I should've had mana on two of my really really good heroes. By the way, I broke like almost full moves 1 on 4 this game. This is my first Jeebus King game in like years. I have my Cassie, I have my Eivor, I have mid, mid control, I took mid 1 on 5, took this 1 on 4. I'm pretty good in this game, except for all the parts where I'm not. I took a 5 for a boss that was all spells, it was 4 crystal dragons, and I lost all my army for the sake of spells after not having wisdom. What the fuck? You know you have to arrow. This arrow? Let's do it. Yeah, kill me! Kill me! What is this? Why am I getting attacked? Wait, why does he have one power, Omega Lol? Omega Roll. Okay. Hmm. Am I winning? <laughs> one power. Lol. Hmm. <laughs> You are definitely winning. I wouldn't say definitely, but possibly. Hmm. Why do you have a square cat? I do not have a square cat. I don't have actually any way to speed up my creatures. <clears throat> Excuse me. I guess I'd have to be the one to go aggressive. And after 45 pity saves your life, are you still gonna abuse the birds? Definitely. You can count on that. I think I just have to brawl. If I did, then I win. How does he deal with that thing of birds, really? Oh shit, is that a golden bow? Yeah, it is. Fuck! Okay, we are most definitely going in. <laughs> um, we flood the battlefield. If you were to slow me, what would my slowest creature be? 7. So he would not be able to connect all these creatures without me getting a turn. 
Which is good. That means I can chill down the next turn, and that's fine. These guys, the five bears, probably just block the. No, they don't. Okay. Haste. Okay, that's fine. Now, if he kills the angel, then it wouldn't be fine. But it looks like he doesn't. Wait, but this cyclops is gonna get the shield. There's no way for me to prevent this anymore. Uh, yeah. Now a shield. Dude, I have a very limited amount of power. And that doesn't matter. This angel should probably just take the retail by this point, I think. Damn, he's gonna get to... Um... Is this a first loss out of frame? Mm. Question mark. Uh, I mean, if I lose, then yes. Is Ace expires next turn? Another big shot is connecting. That's pretty bad. What do you mean if? What I mean by that is that if I were to lose, if that scenario prevails, then the thing that this has happens. Oh damn, we actually get to block these. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, that's absolutely amazing. Oh my god, he actually fucked up. He shouldn't have gotten me to be able to block that. Yeah, he fucked up. Pretty big time, honestly. I'm pretty sure we just killed the power stock. Rehaste. But I get to block this anyway. No, I don't. He can actually block them himself. Uh, shame. All the things that I could have done about this. Oh, he chooses not to. That's been interesting. Does he? Hmm. Okay, he blocks, he blocks. Get here, open up. Yeah, that's what I was expected. It's all hurtful. Uh, kill those guys. Uh, the Thunderbirds will be the power stack that will be dueling. So, and the Vimes are just waiting. Wait, why the haze? What does it do? Am I misunderstanding? What? I think it's like GG ing by doing this. Oh, my first line ball. Oh my god, it was not a myth! <clears throat> I'm actually pretty excited. Uh, I mean, he still doesn't shit. I don't know what this does. I should have said when I win, not if I win. Okay, that's how it is. We win. We win. <laughs>